As with every corruption stream, epilepsy warning. Get down! Ants. Ants! Why does it say ants? Ants she doing here? Ants if she uses ants if she uses the code. Ants alarm will trigger. Ants are you saying? Ants guards. <laughs> Antsy guards. Ants want? Who's ants want? Is that is it Russian name? Ants want. Here's a series of corruptions. Uh, motherfucker. That was a motherfucker of endearment. And also, just went ahead and sabotaged my algorithm on YouTube. We're gonna do Mario 35. Okay, here we go. It's been 35 years since Mario came out. What? Mario won. Game over. It was all just a dream. It was all an illusion. Oh wait, nope, nope. Mario won. Maybe. Vinny, aren't you 35? I'm slightly older than Super Mario Brothers. Yes. Starting with a game over. It's a, a subversion of expectations, and stylistically bold. The name of this corruption is Hold Up to Make He Do Bounce. <laughs> Always good to have some classic Mario 1 corruptions. Nice. Whoa! I wonder if I'll become Fire Flower Mario if I get hit. Okay, never mind. There's no collision anymore. Yo, I'm already Fire Flower Mario. It's nice that we have the real time corruptor and we have Nari and everybody that corrupts to submit new and interesting things like Mario in the sky with diamonds. Speaking of the further evolution of Mario. Uh, Green Mario, Small Mario, Lady Mario, Mario Mario. Here I come. <laughs> Mario raised his hand instead of Luigi. That kind of speaks to the whole Luigi thing to begin with. Like Luigi wants to be the star, and Mario's like, nope. Here I come. So then Mario World, of course, was uh, another amazing Mario game. Um, it was innovative because at this time, really, they just cut Mario down to his bare essentials. The most recognizable feature of Mario. The eyes, nose, and mustache. That's it. That's all you needed. Nintendo, under Shigeru Miyamoto, really went minimal with this one. And it became an iconic game, and, and from this, fo this point forward, Mario had no body. To love. Me. Somebody to love. Why? So then Mario Kart came out, and Mario Kart was um, also very popular for its non-Euclidean um, geometry in the racetracks, which was an innovative feature at the time. Some say it was a very bold move on Nintendo's part to challenge their audience like this, but it paid off in the end. It established a new genre of racing game. And then Sony was like, hey, we gotta release our own non-Euclidean geometrical strange game like this and went on to release um I don't I don't insert game here Crash is a good racing game Here's the thing about Mario Kart 64 I love it I think it might be my favorite memories but it never made me vomit like the original did Well, I guess it's a good follow-up to the non-Euclidean level selection of Mario Kart, the original, in which time and space was distorted and you had to use the minimap to navigate. Nintendo sure likes to push boundaries. All of this Mario Kart stuff has been borderline experimental. Emphasis on mental. Mario Here's what I can say about Mario Kart 64. There is no music on the title screen. Select your player. Yahoo! <laughs> okay. Froze. <laughs> well, well, I guess we're stuck like this. Get a good look at Luigi. 
Thunder. Synthesizer. Flat Katu. And portraits that have stretched beyond infinity and broken the fucking game. I'm gonna load up this next stockpile. Mario 35 Sports Ball. So there is more Mario 35, but not in the thing that you'd expect. Mario Smash Football. <laughs> I didn't even know this game existed. Who is that? Why is there a Kremlin on the field? I don't know what happened. I think Luigi scored his own goal. Luigi wins by doing absol absolutely nothing. That's the usual. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, not so amazing. Anti amazing. Oh, yeah? Oh. It's awesome. All that build up for this. The name of this corruption is Ant Game. I was gonna say, that looks like, um, adolescent Mario who just also so happened to have a mustache. Now it's very much Ant Game. I can't play it. Holy shit. Pretty good. Let's see what this one is. Oh, it's trippy. Mirror skybox. Yo, Mario sounds fucking unhinged. This is Coke Mario. Dude's just drinking way too much soda, too much sugar. The name of this corruption is Yoshi is a Savage. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's dead! Oh my god. <laughs> the name of this corruption is the Faces of Evil. Oh my god. Oh my god! Predator! Jay Leno! Is Waluigi supposed to look like a Mortal Kombat character in that pose? Okay, that was loud. <laughs> He's so much louder than everyone else. What? Waluigi sung the national what? anthem before this, and they forgot to turn his lapel microphone off. Next corruption showcase pack is Lara Croft Tomb Raider. Alien sauce Tomb Raider. <laughs> there she is. Sex icon in the video game world. Can't say no to those, uh, alien limbs. <laughs> that didn't sound good. Welcome, Lara. Oh, shit. When Takamoto arrives, however, it may cause you some Holy inconvenience. Shit. Enjoy the party while you can, and... It's the fucking interstellar bookcase. An error has occurred. Yeah, no shit. The name of this corruption is Lara Likes to Party. Oh, mate, mate, I'm totally fucking mashed. This... Oh my god. Oh, this designer drugs. They call this Smurfacillin. This, this is the hottest new designer drug. <laughs> I 
I didn't even know there was a Tomb Raider on the GameCube, truth be told. So this is news to me. Objective. Go down to the bar and get another drink. Zip, get an eye on You got it. Were, were those? Was that? <laughs> oh, God. They are, chat. They are. I would like to absolve myself from all responsibility. I have not made these corruptions, nor was I aware of these corruptions. Wow, even Laura doesn't buy my shit. Amanda! I think the stone unlocks the door. We're trapped. Ah! Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's how Lara gets her energy. Soon she'll fly away like Dixie Kong in Donkey Kong Country. Hmm, do you see what I see? I don't, is that a zombie? <laughs> it's told in a series of still frames. Oh. Oh no. There seems to be a fine line between coincidence and irony. There was some nonsense about the discovery of the real ah. King Arthur's tomb here years ago. These soon discredited. These faces. And these are the these are the faces of evil. B -b 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 oh shit. This is like <laughs> Mission Impossible, the Matrix. And exist ends all in one. Oh. Press down on the D pad to switch to the sword. Lads. No distractions, please. Good luck. Use that eye. Use it for a sniper rifle. Wow, so powerful the entire like <laughs> the entire temple was destroyed. Imagine the person who made these corruptions telling me to switch to the sword because it's better, as if I would have any idea how to actually continue to play this. If I could in some way latch on to a single thing in this world, I would, but I can't. Holy shit. And, and then... the whole world changed. Some say not for the better. Lara Christ. The Chad X. Mad Pex. Equipped with Yetanium Cannon. Legs are equipped with Juicy Tights. Play until at least Zero's cutscene. Um, it says here, go through Zero's death cutscene. Alright, if I have to go through every level, that's gonna take 20 minutes. Finally, we found Sigma's fortress. Wait a minute, what? Okay, this is fine, then I don't have to go through all the enemies. No problem. What a worthless gesture. Can't be defeated so easily. Where did that energy come from? Roberta Fettuccini. Original character, do not steal. Bruh. <laughs> well, it wasn't Yeet. Boomer Kawanger. Where, where did Mega Man go? Oh, now it works. Works, I said. Holy shit. Uh, I guess I won. 
Guess we're gonna be down on the ground eventually. It's gonna be a thud. Chad X versus Virgin Sigma is the name of this corruption. This can get very silly depending on how much and when you rewind. Uh, it looks like exactly that happened just now. We have now have Thanos Sigma. And he's repeating the dialogue. Man, I hated this fight so much. Something tells me I'm not gonna hate it so much now. Okay, we have dialogue mid-fight. It's entertaining, and it's innovative. Where did the rest of Sigma go? <laughs> Time to take a piss. <laughs> he really is taking a piss. <laughs> it took me a minute to realize what was happening. Lara goes to heaven. The final Tomb Raider game. Her spirit leaves her body, she ascends to uh, heaven, she has to fight God and St. Peter. And the angels, which are confirmed aliens by Tom DeLonge. Oh, what, what's that? Nope, you're not done on Earth yet, Lara. You still have more work to do. 